YouTube, Biker Mike here, back out in the Biker Mike shop. Today I'm going to do a quick review on the Generation 4 King Creek Thud Buster ST suspension seat post. Now this seat post comes in three different post diameters to match up to your bike. Now my bike is an older bike. So the 27.2 was just a touch too big. So I ended up needing to sand off a little bit of the paint here and then I could get it to slide in. And I also had to trim a little bit off the post, but that's just what I had to do. I don't recommend doing that unless you need to. But uh, yeah, so this C post obviously isn't meant to replace like a full suspension bike if you're doing a lot of hardcore off-road mountain biking. But what I was looking for is something to just take those spine tingling, jarring bumps out on my big long bike rides I like to do on a paved bike path. So this fit the bill perfectly and I chose the short travel version. I figured there'd be less of a chance of, you know, the pedal bob thing that you might get. But uh, it turns out I didn't get any of that with it and it works great. It just takes those, like I said, those spine tingler hits out of the bumps. And that was exactly what I was looking for. I didn't notice any pedal bob. And guys, I spend a lot of time on my mountain bike pedaling down a long path. And uh, this definitely helps out if you got any lower back issues. So this version comes with three different elastomers that just pop in and out and you don't need any tools to do that. So it comes with these three, soft, medium, and firm. It came with the medium one installed, so I left that one in, but you can pick out whichever one you need. They also make a couple extra different sizes if you need to go even softer or firmer. But uh, like I said, I left that one in and it works for me and my weight range. You can see it's got like its own linkage system that allows the seat post to move down and back whenever you hit a bump. So I really think this would work great on a commuter bike, an e-bike or any bike that you're just riding around on pavement. Maybe even one of those road bikes, if you do a lot of road biking, if it even would fit on one of those bikes, it might be worth trying out. But for the intended purpose that I bought it for, I'm like really happy with it. I can spend a lot more time on my bike and uh, have less pain from it. So that's what it's all about for me, is just going out for a pedal, staying in shape and uh, keeping that lower back injury free. Now they are a bit pricey, but I think they're worth it. And I'll leave a link down in the description of where you can find one. So there you go, guys. Just a real quick review on the Cane Creek Thud Buster Premium Suspension Seat Post. So thanks for watching. Biker Mike out.